Densplyk first brought you the original Paladin sectional matrix system decades ago. Now, Densply presents the new Paladin Plus, a technologically advanced system designed to help you consistently create tight, accurate contacts on your Class II restorations. Here, we'll perform a mesial occlusal restoration. Begin by choosing either a universal or narrow size Paladin Plus ring and the appropriate matrix depending on the size of the tooth. You'll also need ring placement forceps, a wedge guard, one or two wedges, and pin tweezers. You may choose to first cut the prep, then place the wedge or place the matrix, depending on your personal preference and working style. Here we will place the wedge guard first. Press pin tweezers at the back to open or release and at the front to grip. Grip the hole at the end of the wedge portion of the wedge guard. You'll notice the wedge is anatomically shaped. This facilitates easy placement by actually depressing gingival tissues and minimizing soft tissue trauma. The wedge will expand to fill the embrasure on the lingual side. The guard will protect the adjacent tooth during prep. Remove the guard from the wedge by gripping the hole at the top of the guard with the pin tweezers and sliding laterally. Next, insert a matrix between the wedge and cavity prep. Alternatively, if you choose to cut the prep first, you may follow with the placement of the matrix band. Use the pin tweezers to bend the tab toward you to make placement easier. During placement, use your finger to trap the matrix tab against the adjacent tooth to prevent it from slipping as you place the wedge. Next, load the Paladin Plus ring in the forceps taking care not to overexpand the ring. Be sure the ring is fully seated as shown. If performing a restoration on a small tooth or premolar, you may prefer the Paladin Plus narrow ring. If needed, a second wedge may be placed from the opposite side without removing the ring due to the accommodating shape of the tines, which allow the wedge to be placed after the ring. Using the ball on the pin tweezers, burnish the contact point. Now you're ready to apply a self-etch adhesive, such as Xeno 5 Plus, or to acid etch and apply a total etch adhesive, such as XP Bond. Complete the restoration with a bulk fill material, such as SDR. capped with a universal composite such as Ceramics Mono Plus. After the restoration has been properly placed and cured, remove the Paladin Plus ring using the forceps. Remove the wedge using the pin tweezers. If a bond has formed between the matrix and the composite, you can use a probe to break the bond and facilitate removal of the matrix. Use pin tweezers to grab the matrix wing hole and remove. Over time, the Paladin Plus ring may lose tension. It can be easily reset using the notches in the forceps. If you're interested in finding out more about performing Class II restorations with the revolutionary Paladin Plus sectional matrix system from Densply, ask your Densply local sales representative or visit www.densply.eu.